lastly what we're going to do for this page is our country location selector so if we go back to the site when we click on the country it brings up a full screen pop-up where you can select your actual location uh, americas africa asia pacific europe and so forth right so let's try to create that i'm going to come over here we're going to bring in a box change it to about 1200 okay and make it a bit large and let's see what does it have it has a close and it has a title so let's bring in let's bring in an h2 it says select your location and then let's bring in an h3 for the actual locations so there's africa There is the Americas and Asia Pacific. Again, I'm going to mimic this uh, functionality by creating the most base lowest level representation of that just pick up this um, this group go back to the home page and I'm gonna paste it here and what I need to do is to change the styling on this I'm gonna select the font first change it to black and then the actual icon so the icon the fill change it to black cool and then another thing that I need to do is alt drag is to create like the language. So all I'm going to do is just create a placeholder type uh, design. Like that. And then this one is going to be bolded. And this is like a light gray. And the icon should be fine. I'm going to call this location. And then I'm going to change this into an actual master. And then from the master, we can just override it. So that's going to be a location master. And then we can put it over there. Drag one two three and four then i'm going to select all of them and just drag them out that and also alt drag cool and just one more row awesome and then for asia pacific i'm going to do the same there we go cool then we need a close button. So I'm gonna pick one from the light box. Just pick this guy, command puppy, close. Go back to the home page, scroll to the bottom, over here, and paste. And that's going to be somewhere towards the top. Okay, awesome. And lastly, I'm going to change this into a dynamic panel. But first, let's just center this. There we go, right over there. Okay, right click, uh, select everything, change it into a dynamic panel. I'm also going to kill the background border. So that when we treat it like a light box, uh, the background is also going to be white. So you can't quite tell where this boundary box actually is. Okay, let's name this select location panel. And then command X. And then command X. Let's go into our footer. 
and then paste it in here. What's going to happen is we're going to bring it right about there. Uh, I'm going to set that to hidden and we're going to send it to the back. And then add the interaction onto the location and say when that gets clicked we want to show the location panel yes show we're going to slide it up and we're going to treat it like a light box the background color though is going to be white and it's going to be 100 percent and say okay and then in here for the close when that gets clicked we're going to hide this panel and I'll say done close let's preview that okay there we go cool so it's, it's just about there so select your location is just over we can correct that just now so let's go back to our file double click so this didn't need to be as high we can just bring it down by 10 and let's preview that let's go to the bottom click on country selector select your location awesome and if I click on close, that closes that. So well done for making it this far. We have managed to create our version of the home page, uh, complete with functionality and with the core foundation for the rest of the course. Next up, we're going to be creating the category page, and that's going to be easy to do because we've already created this page.